This is a quick tutorial on how to make the video that you're going to do in the next part of the study. What you want to do is just leave your browser open, don't close it, and look to the bottom of the screen on the taskbar. There you're going to see a icon that looks like a little movie reel. And what you want to do is click it, and that will take you into Movie Maker where you will be making your video. Once you're in Movie Maker, what you want to do probably is start off by looking to see what the title slides have to say. And that'll help you choose which pictures to put in your video. So this is a video about transportation and I'm going to move my cursor along and I can see the title slides talk about different modes in the air, on wheels, human power, public transportation, and so forth. I can also get a feel for what the movie is going to be like by hitting the play button on the preview screen. Okay, so once I have an idea of what the video is going to look like, all I need to do is take the photographs in the collections window pane and drop them into the placeholder that says picture goes here. And I'm going to do that six times, so I have some choice about which photos I'm going to choose. Okay, in the air, I'm going to go ahead and drop these in. This was on wheels. I guess I'll do skateboard. Okay, now I have my pictures in place. I might have to move my music just a little bit so that it is the same length as my pictures. But once those are in place, then I'm ready to add some video effects or transitions. So I'm going to start with effects first. So I'm when I go up to the collections pane in the upper left hand corner, select effects, and then I take any sort of effect that I want to use and I apply it to the picture. So I'm going to put ease in on a balloon. Now I've, now I've got a little bit of movement in there. I might do ease out on the skateboard. I have a little bit of movement in there. Now if I decide that I don't like a transition that I have used and I want to get rid of it, what I need to do is put my cursor on top of the photograph and then I right click on my mouse. That brings up this dialog box where I can then choose video effects and I can remove or add anything that I want to. So I could remove, ease in, and then I would have no, no video effects on this particular picture. If I want to add transitions, all I need to do is select the video transitions in the uh, upper left hand corner and I can put transitions between photographs and title slides. So for example, maybe I'm going to put a dissolve between these two. And now when I go from one to the other, I have a transition. And if I want to remove any of the transitions, all I need to do is select those buttons on the st storyline and I can hit delete. You should save your video frequently. I'm going to hit control S to save. And then the last thing that I can do is view my video. And so I'm going to move my cursor all the way to the beginning of the storyline, go over to the preview window, and I'm going to select play. To see the video in full screen, what you want to do is hit play. And then select the full screen button in the preview window. Hit escape to exit. When you have finished looking at your video, what you want to do is make sure that you've saved your project by clicking Control S. And then when you're done, don't close Movie Maker, but simply go back to your browser and you can then finish the rest of the questionnaire. That's it. Enjoy making your movie.